<sighs> Gods, I hate the evening shift. I'm always dead afterwards. Really? They left the TV on again. They're so damn absent minded. Oi! What the hell are you doing up? It's like 2 a.m. Don't you have commissions due? How could I not? You haven't shut up about it. Yeah, well, I do listen. And I would like to not listen to that damn TV all night, so shut it off and go to bed. I don't care if you can sleep or not, just go to your room and be quiet. You just had a shift in the depths of hell, and if I don't get some rest, I'm gonna lose my shit. Listen, you're my roommate, so I tolerate you to an extent. But you do not want to get between a dragon and their sleep. <sighs> Half dragon. Quit nitpicking. What's your deal tonight? You're normally so chill. Which is why I chose you as my roommate, by the way. The hell is your damage? Oh, for f There's nothing to be scared of. I put up wards. You know I did. Look, if I check the magic wards, will you finally let me rest? Fine. I'll put one up on your door. Come on. Dude, that a There. Now go to bed. Then get a glass of water. Quietly. Good night. What is it now? There are blankets in the closet. Problem solved. What? What more could you possibly want? Shit. Look, don't... I didn't mean I... I'm sorry, okay? I shouldn't have yelled. I just... had an awful day at work. No, you're right. It's not an excuse. I'm sorry. But I am too tired for guessing games right now. Why don't you want to go to bed? Insomnia. You never told me about that. Uh, because I'm your roommate? You ever think that you being up all hours of the night might affect my sleep schedule? No, I'm not going to find another roommate. I don't want another roommate, idiot. I'm going to help you. What do you usually do when you can't sleep? Suffer. Shit, okay. No wonder you act so out of it. You're always tired. You do too. You left the peanut butter out and I had to nag you for days to get your clothes out of the dryer. I just figured you were an airhead. And you're still a hell of a lot better than other roommates I've had. At least you haven't set anything on fire. Yet. Sorry, but seriously, going too long without sleep isn't healthy, dingus. Next time something's bothering you, just come to me. Got it? Yeah, really. I don't keep you around for the hell of it, you know. It means... Well, it means... <sighs> don't make me say it. Obviously I like you, you idiot. I wouldn't live with you if I didn't. I enjoy being your roommate. And if something's wrong, you need to come to me for help. No, I don't have any sleep magic. Not my thing. We might have some tea in the back of the cupboard. Already had some? Okay. Try to warm bath. Alright, check that off the list. Oh, I know. There are these, um, audio stories for Sleep Online. Like, narrations and stuff. What about that? Not even that works. Damn. Uh... Well... Do you know what's causing your insomnia? Stress? Maybe you just eat too much junk. I know I have a sweet tooth. Huh? What'd you say? <laughs> Scared and what? A little louder. Lonely. Ah. Oh. Mm. Well. 
maybe I can stay in your room. On the floor. If it means I can sleep. <laughs> Where the hell else would I sleep? Is it, don't be ridiculous. Why would... I mean, you... I can't sleep in your bed. Because that's... <laughs> we're not dating. It'd be weird. Besides, you probably kick in your sleep. Oh yeah, you totally do. I can tell. Oh, come on. Don't give me those eyes. <sighs> Fine. But kick me once, and I'm going back to my room. Now come on. I just finished a double shift, and I'm about to pass out. Um... What the hell? Where am I supposed to sleep? I mean, your bed is overrun with stuffed animals. I don't know how you expect to fit on there, let alone both of us. Look, if you want me to sleep with uh, next to you, then you need to shove some of these things aside. Sorry. Friends. You'll need to shove some of these friends aside. A little more. There. Go to sleep, Ruby. Be still. <sighs> What's wrong? Yeah, well, there isn't enough room for me and your big teddy. Cuddle one of the smaller plushies. Arm support. Jeez, you're so high maintenance. Fine, come here. Because I'm letting you wrap an arm around me. Obviously. Yes, I'm sure. Get over there. Of course I'm warm. I'm a half dragon. Quit fidgeting. Just curl up onto my chest. There. Comfortable. Good. Nah, it's not weird. It's actually nice. <laughs> Your breath kind of tickles. It doesn't bother me. Go to sleep, Rumi. You're still tense. Hey, it's okay. What about this? Let me trace my claws into your back, real gentle. There. Just focus on how it feels. I'm gonna wrap my tail around you. Like a weighted blanket. There we go. I've got you. Getting sleepy? Good. Hey. Before you go to sleep, i got to tell you something. It's important. You totally owe me breakfast in the morning. I'm thinking pancakes. <laughs> okay, okay. I'll help make it. Yeah. Yeah. I can stay with you tomorrow night, too. Good night, Rumi. <laughs> 